guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 11 of D4 DJ First Mix. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Yeah, they're literally showing this again. Okay, Kyoko, Mermaid, <laughs> the last three girls I need. Please come home at least today or tomorrow. These are the last two days that we're getting free 10 plus 1 tickets. And I need you to, you three, to come home. That's all I care about. I would love to finish Mermaid today because they're my best unit and I love them so much. But still, your girl wants Kyoko on the side because there's no way in heck I'm getting those Fontaine Maiden cards. And that's okay. Congratulations! Oh my god, pizza. Is that margarita pizza though? I know! She's right. Heck, and anybody else too who makes up. Thank you. <laughs> Thank God, I thought she would be really pissed. Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it has to be. What else could it be? Ah! <laughs> I'm finally playing mermaid songs. Oh, my God! Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh, of course she was. Mm -hmm. I know, right? Do you want to remix it, Saki? Heck, it wouldn't surprise me that this is going to be a new song that's going to be in the game today. I'm guessing that means yes! <laughs> You were seriously up all night? Saki. But it's done, isn't it? Shouldn't even place. Oh. Poor baby. Baby. <laughs> Pink grasshopper. just Saki she wants to just talk but you know no <laughs> precious baby <laughs> you 
Yeah, because she wants to ask you something. Yeah, but she wants to know now. <laughs> She's so precious. <laughs> My babies. Finally. <laughs> oh my god, she's so precious! Mm-hmm. Basically, she wants to try something different. Mm -hmm. A new sound, something. I like it. It's nice. No, Sanki, you're so precious. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought Noah was taller. No, I mean not Noah. Toa was taller. <laughs>
Poor baby. Oh! Are you okay? No, don't say that. It's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's good to be different, though. Mm -hmm. But you don't know unless you'll try. But you have to take that risk. Hmm? Oh, Noah. <sighs> mhm mm and she said yeah so take it mhm mm It's going to be okay. It's kind of acoustic-y in a way. I like it though. It's different. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
If they don't get an applause. There we go. I was about to say. <laughs> it's so precious. I can't. Oh my god. Okay, so number one. Let's talk about the fact that Finally, finally, after 11 weeks, Mermaid has officially made an appearance in this show. Even though it is, they're not 3D, they were mainly 2D images in a background <clears throat> for a video. But your girl is happy because they finally made a freaking appearance. I've been waiting for this. Now really, you just need Lyrical Lily. With two episodes left, they can do it if they really want to. Or they could wait until we get a second season, which might come out later on this year. Because I think they're going to do that as well. But who knows? But this episode for Fanta Maiden specifically was good. I do like the remix version of the song. It's very acoustic -y. Um... It seems like it is their image. I think Saki did a beautiful job with the song. I love the fact that they really remixed it. I love also the fact that I don't remember Rochelle's character's name in this anime. That their producer, Rochelle, was okay with them doing this. Because sometimes, yes, you have to take that risk. Even if the four of you think it's a really good song, and in the end, if she would have said no... I think still Fonta Maiden as a group would have been like, we're going to do this anyway, with or without your opinion. But it was good. It was really good. Hopefully it's in the game because I'm going to play it how many times until I get, you know, perfect combo and score and ish. Oh. Oh, we about to do that. Uh, you know what? And that makes sense because we've gone 11 weeks into this series and we've never really seen Mooney and Riku fight and argue to the point where Riku does cry and such. I mean, because like I said, their relationship reminds me a lot of Kasumi Arisa and you can see the Kasumi Arisa vibes like they're any time when there's like a little argument or something almost to the point where yeah you you think Rinko's gonna cry but she's not gonna cry but the fact that we're finally going to be seeing this I think this is going to be an episode that we really need because of the fact is these two have known each other since they were kids and I think whatever Mooney is going to say to Rinko it's going to be something that she isn't gonna expect Moni to say to her so uh, of course it's gonna hurt her feelings no matter what it's gonna be like the freaking quintuplets episode that I watched yesterday that the reaction came out today where um Nino and Itsuki got into a fight and we're still having these two into a fight and the following episode that'll come out next week we're gonna see how they're gonna resolve so hopefully it works out well for them it'll do something good for the relationship and something that they really need because it has happens to everybody you know whether it's a friend group um co-workers your bandmates 
whatever people who you're playing a game with something like that you're all going to disagree on something and some things you're gonna agree on but you're gonna have to fight with them because it's natural we're all going to agree to disagree on something but yeah other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of D4DJ First Mix. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Friday for episode 12. Bye, guys.